Look around on your mower for a label that shows the most frequently replaced parts. The label on my 2002 Husky Supreme LT is under the seat. Please pay special attention to the numbers and belt position. Here is the non-OEM replacement belt that we will use. I generally do not recommend non-OEM parts, but I am going to take a gamble this time since it was less than half the cost and appears well made. Notice that this belt is shaped differently on each side. It is referred to as a V-belt. To make it easier to work, we are going to drop the deck. We need to pull the pins that hold it up, and they are located between the rear wheel and the rear wheel well. To lower the deck, simply pull out the pin, minding the raised bumps on both sides of the pin. Do this on each side of the tractor. Next, we will remove the three bolts on the left-hand deck pulley cover using a 3 8 inch socket and then remove the cover. Move the PTO lever downward to disengage the idler pulley and remove the broken belt if it is still present. Place the replacement belt on the topmost channel of the deck pulley and angle it towards the front of the mower where the engine pulley is located. To the far right of the video shown is the engine pulley. In the middle are these two idler pulleys, and to the far left is the deck pulley that we started our belt at. Route the belt around the engine pulley, and then around the idler pulleys, as my hand is instructing in the video. Pay attention to these brackets that the belt feeds into between both idler pulleys. Now that the belt is fed, and if you lowered your mower deck, raise the front of the mower deck as I have and ensure that it is situated as far back towards the mower as possible. Ensure that the mower deck is in the lowermost setting. By lowering the mower deck lever, these bars will drop and allow us to insert pins that attach the deck. We will insert the pin into the outermost receiving hole. Do this on each side of the tractor. Raise the deck back into the highest position. Feel free to test the newly installed belt, taking note of the moving pulley at the bottom right of this video. If it is spinning and you can tell the blades are moving, the new belt is working. Shut the mower down when complete. When returning the deck pulley, Pay attention to these two metal rods that extend outward. They must be on the outside of the belt to hold it in place against the pulley. Line up the screw holes and reaffix the three cover bolts with a 3 8 inch socket. With a little skill and likewise effort, you should be back in business. If this content was helpful, please consider liking and subscribing.